Hi. Today, I'm going to show you what's in my bag. I watch all of the Vogue What's in My Bag videos. I'm obsessed with them all. <laughs> and I have a recent addition to my bag collection, so I thought it was the perfect time to show you what is in my bag, but also give you all the deets on my sweet new baby angel. This is the Celine Romy bag. Now, the gal at the Celine store told me that it was pronounced Rumi, but I'm really struggling with that. It's R-O-M-Y. Either way, this is she. I got it in the tan leather, and there's also a white one. Oh my God, actually there's four shades in this bag, but this tan one is just, she is a beauty, and she also fits all of my everyday necessities, and there's a lot that gets crammed in here, so maybe it really is the Rumi, with good reason. It's got a nice pebbling to it, so it uh, keeps all of the scratches and bangs at bay, and it also has beautiful gold hardware, it's got an adjustable strap and when it's like really full it kind of sits like this like a rectangle but because it's a nice little cutie shoulder bag it actually just folds nicely like this and sits under your shoulder and i usually would only ever go for like big tote bags or crossbody messenger bags i've never really dabbled in the shoulder bag life but this has been super comfortable and amazing to carry around and i've been wearing it everywhere. I truly can't get enough of this bag. It's so good. It was definitely a spendy piece, but I think it's one of those gorgeous classic styles that'll just last forever. And I really love that Celine has that kind of not very showy branding. It's really nice and subtle. And yeah, I just, this color is perfect. The gold is perfect. And let's dive in and see what's inside. So the first item obviously is my phone. Uh, it's my uh, fifth limb and I don't go anywhere without it. Following the phone, and equally as important, is my wallet. All of my goods are in here, all my cards, license, receipts, all that good stuff. I used to carry a really big wallet around, and then I downsized to a card holder, and it's actually been really great. And I, it just forces me to have to get rid of all the extra crap that I used to carry in my larger wallet. So this is my little Louis Vuitton empreinte wallet card holder. Oh my God. I will say that I am a gal of tradition and I know that a lot of people have just fully switched over to the phone for like Apple pay receipts, all that stuff. Give me a paper receipt. Let me pay with my card. Let's just get through all the basics, shall we? We've got our keys and Dan and I have been making the habit of putting an Apple AirTag on everything, especially, I mean, when we travel, we're putting it in all of our bags. When we moved, we put it in our moving boxes. We've got the Apple tags on the keys. Don't want to lose these. And oh my God, also our car key, little leather. We need a new carrier. This will be with the Fallen very soon. <laughs> Next up, we've got some tissue papers. Uh, for obvious reasons, I am allergic to my cat and I'm constantly blowing my nose and so is Dan. We never go anywhere without our Kleenex. <laughs> this is the latest and greatest addition to my everyday purse. This is my little moleskin planner, how cute. If you saw the London vlog, you'll know that Dan and I both got little initialed planners. And it's bright blue. I was actually gonna get the black and Dan was like, babe, get a color, come on, add some color to your life. And I was like, you are correct. I used to be really, really good about writing everything down in my planner and I kind of went off for a little bit, I guess like we spent a lot of time at home and I wasn't like going out so much and that's kind of continued, <laughs> but really need to get back into writing down all of my days and stop doing it on my computer because I really like to write things down. And then to go with the planner, I always have a pen. Always have a pen. You never know when you're gonna need it, but you always end up needing a pen. Always have a pen with you. What else in here? Oh my word. I wear a lot of white and I stain all of my clothing. I always have a tied to go pen. They actually have little mini ones, which are cute, but I find I use them up really fast because I, I literally have no bottom lip. I'm constantly spilling all over myself. It's really embarrassing, so. Help, <laughs> help. Gum, my friends, do not be the person with bad breath. Whether you prefer mints or a little spray, whatever, gum. I always have gum with me. And it's funny actually, because I did have my Invisalign trays in for the last year and I like couldn't chew gum. And there was so long, it felt like the most bizarre thing to not have gum in my mouth because I'm definitely a gum chewer and uh, it feels good to be reunited with my old friend. And I just always get the XL white. I don't know why, it's just like my preferred flavor. I love the green one. Don't give me the blue. I don't know, it's just, it's just good. It's good and I like to smell fresh, always. Nail file. Now I do get my nails done and I've been getting like a hard gel, but I get really, really bad 
hangnails and like the little skin and bits. And I just find I'm just always needing to do a little bit of maintenance on the side. Like I can't, if you have a little hangnail and it starts getting caught and everything, I can't <laughs> function. I must have a nail file with me to buff that away. Always have one on hand. Speaking of hand and nail care, I've got a hand cream. I have, well, like I said, hangnail problems, really, really dry cuticles, dry hands. Always, I always have a hand cream with me. This is the Caudalie Hand and Nail Cream. Swiftly making my way through this lovely little guy. She smells delicious, and I like to be moisturized on all of my orifices. We've got lots more cleaning things in here. Like I said, I like to smell good, but I also like to be clean. So we've also got some hand sanitizer. This is a cute little, um, sanitizer spray that's very lovely to have on hand. Then I've also got wet ones, antibacterial wipes. This is more so for the airplane, like I always have these in my little travel bags, but it's summertime, I'm sweaty, I'm sticky, I need to have these with me to wipe wherever I may need to. Then I've also got these cute little wipes for my screen. Your phone, your screen is disgusting. My Apple Watch gets disgusting. Gotta have <laughs> little wipes to help that. So at this point in my life, I'm most known for my margarita burns. <laughs> I had some phytophotodermatitis on my hands a few years back, and it made me very much aware of how much your uh, hands are very exposed to the sun, especially when you're driving a lot, which I do now that I live out of the city. So this is a lovely little Super Goop Cloud9 Mineral Sun Balm, and I'm trying to remind myself to put this on specifically before I drive because of my little margarita adventure. My hands are much more sensitive and they're also like much more white. The, th the skin is much more thin on my hands, so gotta keep it protected. Speaking of sunshine and sunscreen, it is summer, so I've been carrying a little sunscreen stick on. Obviously, I wouldn't put this on when I have makeup on, but for the most part, when I'm going outside during these summer months, I do not have any makeup on. So I've got this little face sunscreen stick. This is the Shiseido Clear Sunscreen Stick, SPF 50. Really satisfying. I picked this up when I was overseas recently. This lovely little clear bomb. Smells good, feels good on the face, and I've just been keeping that for on-the-go moments just in case. How many creams and lotions and potions can one gal have? Not enough, apparently. <laughs> so I have my lip balm. Always have a lip balm. There's a different lip balm in every bag. This one is the Nude Sticks Nude Skin Hydropeptide Lip Butter with Shea and Avocado. Absolutely delicious. Love this lip balm. And I have perpetually dry lips, so always need to put something on them. Hair elastic, always. I can't be without entertainment or music when I'm on the go, so next item, naturally, is my, my headphones. I have the little AirPods. Fun fact about my ears, my ears are bent down and I can't wear like regular headphones, so I have to have the little marshmallows, which is very annoying and also really gross. Because I don't really know how I'm meant to clean this properly. Perhaps I could use one of the little screen wipes, but either way, always have to have my AirPods with me so that I can be jamming out when I am rocking around. Now, I previously touched on the fact that I'm very much aware of how I smell and one, you know, maybe I should consider carrying a little deodorant around actually, but I don't at this moment. Maybe I will someday, but until then I've got my fragrance. This is one of my favorites of all time. This is the replica by the fireplace. I'm almost out of this one, but don't you worry. I do have a backup upstairs. So this is just, it smells like heaven. I wear it all year round and like to do a little spritz, a little touch up on the go if I need to. Listen, when I'm on the go, I get starving. <laughs> I need to have a snack with me. And I love that Costco sells these like giant boxes of these little fruit source bars. And I, I like the amount of these that I go through in a week, like there's wrappers everywhere. I'm obsessed with these, they're so good. I have no flavor preference. I will eat them all. Dan, how many of these do you think I eat in a week? Way too many. <laughs> Are you as shocked as I am that all of this has fit in the bag thus far? I know. Well, we've reached the bottom and I'm kind of embarrassed to admit this to you, but maybe you can see it in the bottom. Yeah, you can right there uh, to pluck the fruit source bar and all of the things out of my teeth. I am an obsessive flosser. <laughs> I have dental floss with me at all times. Um, this just seems much more space efficient than having a little, what would you call it? The little box, the little stringy floss. I don't like those. I like the little picks because I like to be able to pick and floss all at the same time. And yes, I do just keep these free falling in all of my bags. And yeah, I just, I can't have food stuck in my teeth. So if I'm going out and I just have a rogue <laughs> piece of something stuck in my teeth, I must be able to immediately remove it. I always have these little picks just living in the bag. Please don't judge me. I've accepted myself for how I am with that. <laughs>
And with that, my friends, those are all of the things that I keep in my bag. So I hope you enjoyed seeing all of the things that I carry around with me. I'm realizing now that it's quite a lot, but all of these things are very helpful with me in my, in my daily life. So <laughs> let me know in the comments down below if you enjoyed this video. And I would also love to hear what things that you hoard around with you throughout the day. And uh, my friends, I'm gonna love you and leave you here. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you all very soon for a new video. Bye.